Hey guys, it's Jen. Uh, today we are going to do the Noble Garden event quest. We have a few days left and I decided to throw this up for anybody who had some questions. Um, I'm just picking up the beginner quest. You don't have, really have to worry too much about these. They're super easy. Um, what you do have to worry about though is getting your Spring Plane Strider mount. Yes, definitely are going to want this. Um, basically, you can actually get it from the eggs that you collect as well, but I wasn't lucky enough to get it. I know some people get it like on their first or second egg, but no, I had to get 500 chocolates to get it. Um, what you guys see here though is a few of the other items that you can get during the event. Um, you don't need to worry too much about them because they actually drop from the eggs as well and they are a higher drop rate than, than your mount, so don't worry. Um, I do want these bunny ears though and the pink ones. They're adorable. You guys, they're so adorable. Um, so what I'm going to show you guys is a couple places that I actually found to be um, pretty good spots to collect your eggs, especially if you're on like a high populated realm. You're not going to want to just run around and collect the eggs. Um, they're going to be people just camping every corner that has eggs. So um, here it is in Razor Hill. I found this place to be the best spot. You had like three locations that you could pick up eggs. And Goldshire, um, if you run along this path area by the target, the best spot I found was out here around the lake. If you wanted to camp a spot, these bushes over here, they hide like three eggs. You can just stand in the middle between those and work. Um, Dolinar, however, was the best place for me to collect eggs. Um, it depends again on your realm and where people are looking, but running around this house, like it was a continual spawn of eggs that worked really well. So once you get your bags full of eggs, you guys, you get to go through the daunting task of opening every single one of them and collecting your chocolates, or um, you'll see like the tuxedo set that I got, the elegant dress, um, even your spring robes, you get the bunny ears, you get a lot of stuff from these eggs. But like I said earlier, you guys, I, I didn't get that. I had to wait, I had to collect my 500th egg. So you see me here opening them, the last four to get my 500. I was so excited though. Finally, I could finally get them out. Sadly, I had to say goodbye to my bunny ears. I don't know if I can collect another 100, you guys. That was so bad, so bad. <laughs> but as you can see, I got my mount. It's gorgeous, it's pretty funny. Um, it's, it's like an ostrich, it's cute. The other places I wanted to show you guys though were the different zones where you'll be able to collect eggs. Um, you'll want to do your achievements and stuff here as well. Um, you saw just previously I had Brill, here's Falcon Wing Square, and Bloodhoof Village for the Horde. I heard Bloodhoof Village was the place to be. I don't know about your, your realms, but it's supposedly the best place on Smolderthorn. And here we go with the Alliance Cities. We had Dolinar, we have Karanos, and Azure Watch. You guys, I'm slaughtering the Alliance names. I'm sorry. <laughs> For those of you who are interested though, we have the Meta achievement to get the Noble title. Um, so what you're gonna wanna do is eat 25 chocolates, which is super easy to do. I mean, you just sit and spam, eat chocolate. It's the only time you can get away with it, I swear. <laughs> Uh, the next quest, this one's a little different. You're going to probably want to get with a party member and you're going to want to use your blossoming branch. And you guys will fly out to Ungoro Crater to um, the little steam lakes that they have out here. Um, what you'll want to do is you change each other into a bunny and you lay an egg and you get your achievement. Uh, moving on, like I was saying before, when you're visiting the other starter zones, um, you're going to want to have your spring rabbit out. And um, what you want them to do is hang out with another party member's rabbit. They'll have their little tiny bunnies. It's adorable. Um, but you get your achievement for each city that you go to to get that done. Um, and then also for you Stormwind Alliance people, this, this next thing I'm going to show you. I was in Silvermoon because I'm bored. Um, what you're going to want to do is go to the vendor and buy an egg for five chocolates and you're going to want to hide it somewhere within your city. I, I really don't think you have to hide it, but I took it literally. So I'm like, I'm hiding it in the bushes. Get your achievement. Make sure you collect it again though because you'll get a chocolate back, which is kind of nice. 
Okay, you guys, this next little achievement, what you're gonna wanna do is place bunny ears on um, all the female characters above the level of 18. It's pretty silly. Um, the best places that I found is for your opposite faction is either like going and derping up in battlegrounds or um, trying to like fight your way into their city to do it. It's, it's gonna be ridiculous. Um, the next quest here is you're going to want to go to like the barren zones. It's going to tell you like Desolus, Badlands, things like that. And use your spring robes to plant a flower. Um, pretty, pretty easy. It's just more annoying having to fly around than anything. Um, and then your last achievement that you're going to want to get is while you're in your tux little set, you're going to want to slash kiss somebody in elegant robes. Um, I have both sets on, as you can see here, to kind of make it easier. Um, but yeah, you guys, that's that's pretty much it to get your noble achievement. Um, I hope you guys have fun, and I will see you all later.